Aaron, what does it say about this team uh, to get another one of these wins in a close game like this, uh, considering it's now 71 games and your record is 48 and 23? You know, I would say, one, they're really good players in there. Um, we're familiar in those situations. So I think, you know, they play with a lot of confidence in these close games. And, you know, I think the more you play in them, the more comfortable you get. You know, it's it's not always been easy or perfect, but these guys are really good at competing, uh, you know, especially when the game's in the balance. And and obviously we've lost some in, in those situations. We've lost some really tough ones, but I think these guys do a really good job of of not dwelling on it, being able to bounce right back. And, and some of our best wins have come out after some of our worst losses. So it was another case of the guys really, you know, competing really well, you know, Credit to Oakland for kind of crawling back in, and then the bullpen from there was able to really, really shut them down and allow us to to put together a little bit of a rally there late. Early in the game, it was the two pitches to Judge and uh, Gallo that that really set everybody off, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, what about Jameson tonight? Uh, he's been lights out since July sixth. Yeah. Uh, probably one of your best starters since then. Yeah. Uh, what did you see out of him tonight? You know what? I thought stuff-wise, you know, and, and mostly for me watching on TV, so I had the same view you had. I, I thought stuff-wise he was good. You know, I thought I thought his curveball was good. I thought the fastball was playing. I thought the A's did a good job of, of you know, putting together some really competitive at-bats, especially in that fourth inning where they were able to work some walks. I thought Chapman had a really good at-bat laying off a tough 3-2 pitch. Um, and then he made the mistake to to Andrews on an 0-2 pitch, throwing a right down the middle that kind of, you know, cost him the outing a little bit there. Um, you know, I thought there were some times where he had a chance to gain some count leverage where he, you know, were some of his worst pitches. So that pitch where you're 1-1, 2-1, he was taking it to 3-1 and got in a little bit of trouble with that. But I don't think he was far off. Um, and I thought stuff-wise he was good. Thanks, Aaron. Yeah. You can go next to Bruce Beck. Aaron, are you used to every game being like life and death with this ball? <laughs> <laughs> we we are used to playing in these, uh, Bruce, no question. Um we've we've by far and away obviously played more than anyone else. So uh the guys are definitely comfortable in these situations and um you know uh there's never any panic with these guys. Um, you know, I think they they play with a lot of confidence when the game's on the line and, and in the balance. And again, doesn't mean you're always going to come through, but I know that they're not going to be uh, rattled or overwhelmed by any situation. How significant was the job that Holmes and Luizica did for you? Yeah, it was great. I mean, Holmes coming in and, and shutting it down, uh, you know, really like he's done you know, since he's gotten here to us, he was he was great through those those right-handed hitters, and then low, you know, going two innings right through the middle of their order. Thought he threw the ball really well, um, and then Chappie uh, finishing off and getting that 300 was was everyone's very excited. Can you go next to Dan Martin. Aaron, just to get get Chapman that save and, and have him get out of that inning. Um, you know, where where do you think he is now? Uh, in terms of performance and, and confidence. Yeah, uh, look, I thought that was a big outing for him. Um, Matt and Hark, you know, uh, made some subtle adjustments with him today that that I, I thought Chappie did a good job but was able to go out in his catch play and before the game and kind of work it out, and he took it into the game, and I thought he did a good job on the attack. Um, and, and really, you saw him use his fastball tonight and not shy away from the fastball. And uh, I think the little subtle adjustment he made in his posture on the mound, I think, really helped him. Can you 